Hey, this is Metal Mike and welcome to my new column called The Perfect Pair. And in this column we're going to talk about marrying two rhythm guitar parts in order to make him sound big and melodic. This is two guitarists obviously are the bedrock of heavy metal guitar playing and having two guitar players playing the same riff makes things heavy. But when they, we all go out and do our own thing, um, makes the music come alive and, and becomes more melodic and just sometimes interesting to listen to. So this is a very big part of metal as we know. I'm going to show you a couple ways of orchestrating a simple heavy metal chord progression and you're going to see bands such as Maiden, Children of Bottom, Priest or even Halford do things like that. So check it out. Okay, so the main rhythm part is basically a power chord progression. I go from E, 5, to C, 5, to A, to B. And it's basically one big whole note for each chord. Now the first example of an ex expanded part is this little 16 note rhythm with different accents on it, okay? It goes like this, I'll play it slow for you. So I'm basically outlining the main rhythm chords with just two note little dyads. I'm playing a fourth here for the E, I'm playing a third here, a major th third for the C. I'm playing A5, uh, basically a power chord for the A that I played back there. And another B uh, major uh, little diet here. So I'm giving these chords almost like, I am indeed giving these chords a, a harmony uh, uh, to it, sort of brings the, brings the ear back. So let me show you two more ideas of how you can add these little 16 note rhythms over the original power chords. Okay, so this example is played with all single notes and you are utilizing only downstrokes, okay? Now, the tricky part in this riff is that you want the melody parts to really come out nice and bright, but you want that bottom fourth string, the rhythm string, right, to really clearly ring. And that is quite an interesting and sometimes hard thing to do. Okay, so as you're practicing this riff, make sure that everything sounds nice and clean. Check it out. <laughs> See how all the notes sound nice and even and loud? That's what you got to go for. All right, so for this last example, we are going to combine a little bit of a rhythm and a little bit of a melody. The melody gets a little bit more complicated. Check it out all together.
Okay, so this example combines the little two note rhythms with some melodies and you, make you have to make sure that the rhythm sounds nice and in tune and the, and the melody notes really pop out. You really want to hit some harmonics on the notes on, the, on that G string in order for, for, uh, for the riff to have a cool contour. Okay, this is what I'm doing slowly. <laughs> Next chord. Back to the A here. Little change on the B. So you want to make sure that B really rings out, okay? Check it out. Okay. 